Hello everybody and welcome back to more of Pokemon Leaf Green. Last time we took on the Celadon City Gym and its leader Erica. And in this episode, we're back in the Rocket Game Corner. And as you remember when we first explored Celadon City, there was a Team Rocket grunt standing right in front of this poster. And after we defeated him, he went through the wall. And after we flipped a switch behind this Rocket poster, that staircase appeared. So, in this episode, we're gonna head down. Welcome to the Team Rocket Hideout. There are many grunts to fight in here. Some of them required, some are not. But, we're gonna face as much as we can, beginning with this guy. Who are you? How did you even get here? Alright, this Team Rocket Grunt has two Pokémon. Out first is going to be a Drowsy. Alright, Jolteon, let's see what you can do. Shockwave! There we go. Headbutt only does 10 damage. Let's use a Quick Attack. Oh, so close to taking it out! But this Quick Attack will. And there we go, we get a critical hit when we don't even need it. Beautiful. Alright, so, down goes Drowsy. Next up is going to be a Machop. We will stay in. Alright, and let's use Shockwave again. There we go. Down goes Machop, and that is going to do it for this battle against this Team Rocket Grunt. Ow! Beaten! Alright, there we go! So, now if we come over here, there's another Rocket Grunt to fight. You broke into Team Rocket's operation? What nerve! Alright, this Team Rocket Grunt has two Pokémon out first is going to be a Raticate! And go Jolteon! This is the perfect experience for Jolteon to get. These Pokémon are five levels average lower than us, so that will be good to level up Jolteon, since Jolteon is very far behind Nidoking and Charizard. Another Shockwave should do it here for Raticate. There we go, a critical hit again when we don't need it. That's awesome. And that's so close for Jolteon to get to level 27. Next up is another Raticate. We will stay in. And let's use Shockwave once more. Wow, that actually did a lot the second time for this Raticate. Hyper Fang! Ooh, God. Let's use Shockwave. Luckily, Shockwave never misses. And down goes Raticate. Which means, Jolteon is now level 27. And that's gonna do it for this battle against this Team Rocket Grunt. Boom! Alright, there we go. Is there anything over here? Yes, there is. It's a Pokeball. And it contains an escape rope. So if we want to, we can escape here anytime we want. Alright, now let's head down the stairs. Now we're in the second basement floor, and there's a Rocket Grunt right there. Let's avoid him for now. There's a Grunt right there. Ah, puzzles! I love these. Okay. Um, We'll be able to get that if we come over here. Yeah, there we go. A rare candy. Alright. Now we have to head this way, and back around. Okay, and now we come around here, and do that. There we go. We can avoid that fight for now, and pick up a black glasses that boosts up the attack of Dark-type moves. Alright, let's head down the stairs. And right here you can pick up a Max Ether. Excellent. And there's a Grunt to fight. This Grunt is very important. Right here's a TM-49 Snatch. This guy will give you a very important item to, prog to progress 
to progress in the hideout. The elevator doesn't work? Who has the lift key? Alright, this rocket grunt has two Pokemon, and out first is a coughing. Behold, the culprit for global warming. Let's use Shockwave. There we go, take out coughing in one shot. Take that, global warming! Next up is Zubat. We'll stay in. Let's use Shockwave. And there we go! Both Pokémon down like that, which means that is going to do it for this battle against this Team Rocket Grunt. No! Oh no! I dropped the lift key! Plop. <laughs> That's a really funny line. Anyway, we got the lift key, which means we can now use that elevator we saw earlier. Awesome, right? Okay. So, really quickly, I'm gonna battle the other Rocket Grunts that we skipped over. Stop meddling in Team Rocket's affairs, or else. Alright, this Rocket Grunt has three Pokemon out first is a Rattata. Alright, Jolteon, you're a bit low, so just in case, I'm going to use a Super Potion right now. I probably should have done this before the battle, but, you know, you live and you learn. Okay, it only used Tail Whip. I was gonna say, because I was afraid it would use Quick Attack and we'd get one-shotted, because you know how Rattatas are, they can annoy you when you least expect it, so. Anyway, a Shockwave here is going to take out Rattata, beautiful. Alright, so, the next Pokémon is going to be Eradicate, and we are going to stay in. Alright, let's use Shockwave once more. Oh, so close. If only we were a level higher. Tail Whip's gonna lower our defense, but that is not going to matter. Let's use Quick Attack. There we go. Alright, one Pokémon remains, and that Pokémon is... Drowsy! And we are going to stay in. The Shockwave should do the trick. Or not. And now Shockwave is, dis is disabled. Alright, let's use Return then. Oh, come on! Drowsy! Why? And we're disabled after... Undisabled after one turn. Okay. Anyway, down goes Drowsy. That's gonna grow Jolteon to level 28. And that is also going to do it for this battle. Against this Team Rocket Grunt. Oof! Taken down! Alright, and now I believe all we need to do is do this. Yes! Now go up here. There we go. Alright. Hey, Mr. Rocket Grunt, what's going on? We got word from upstairs that you were coming. I don't understand how, since I didn't battle anybody upstairs. Yet. Alright, this Rocket Grunt has two Pokémon, and out first is a Machop! Perfect experience uh, gaining for Jolteon here. I mentioned this earlier, but I gotta say, it's really helpful to have this. Anyway, down goes Machop. That was quick. Next up is going to be another Machop, and we will stay out. Alright, another Shockwave. I'm running out of these, though, so I'll probably have to heal up at the Pokémon Center. And there we go! Both Machops are down, and that's gonna do it for this battle against this Team Rocket Grunt. What? I lost? No! Alright, there we go, and down here is an item. It's a TM21 Frustration. Basically, it's the opposite of TM27 Return. The more the Pokémon hates you, the stronger the move is. Alright, hey Rocket Grunt, what's going on? 
boss said you can see ghosts with the Sylph Scope. Alright, this Rocket Grunt has five Pokemon. Out first is a Zubat. Alright, Jolteon, let's use Shockwave. There we go. Alright, the next Pokemon is going to be a Coughing. Alright, we'll stay in. Shockwave once more. Alright, next up is going to be a Grimer, and we are going to stay in. Let's use Return. Okay, that did a good amount of damage, although now it's disabled. That's okay, we can use Quick Attack. Oh, close! Very close. A critical hit pa- Really? Disable again? Wears off after one turn? What is that about? Anyway, a critical hit. And next up is going to be a Zubat. Stay out. And use Shockwave. There we go. And the last Pokemon for this Team Rocket Grunt is going to be Eradicate. And we are going to stay out. And use Shockwave. And there we go. All five Pokemon have been eradicated. And that is going to do it for this. Oh, well, Jolteon grows to level 29. That's great. But that's going to do it for this battle against this Team Rocket Grunt. I surrender! Alright. Now, before we move on with this puzzle here, I'm going to go heal up at the Pokemon Center, so I will meet you back here in just a second. Alright, we're back, and now let's move on. Okay, let's pick up these items around here. First up is a Moonstone, then we come around here and pick up this item, which is an X-Speed. Alright, now let's just do that. Uh, we pick up this item by doing that, and this is a TM-12 Taunt. Alright, uh, I believe we do it like this, yes, and now... Do that, do that, go that way, and there we go. Now, ooh, stairs. Ah, uh, more rocket grunts to fight, huh? Oh, there's an item. It's a hyper potion. All right. Well, let's battle more rocket grunts. Hey, guy, turn around. Why did you come here? Alright, this Rocket Grunt has four Pokemon. Up first is going to be a Rattata. Go Jolteon! Jolteon's all healed up. Look at that. 20 Shockwaves. Beautiful. Let's use Return. There we go! Critical! Hit! Take it out! I guess Jolteon's starting to love me, huh? Alright, next up is going to be Eradicate. We are going to stay in. And we're going to use Shockwave. There we go. Alright, next up is going to be Eradicate. Another one. And we'll stay in. And let's use Shockwave once more. Oh, quick attack. Hello. Well, this Shockwave's gonna hurt ya. There we go. Alright, and the final Pokemon for this Team Rocket Grunt is going to be another Rattata. And we'll stay in. This guy sure loves the Rattata family. Oh, another quick attack. Beautiful. Let's use Return. 
Oh, close. Quick attack! Yeah, I'm faster! Alright, down goes Rattata, and that is going to do it for this battle against this Team Rocket Grunt. This won't do! Alright, there we go. And now, let's fight this Rocket Grunt here. Intruder alert! Intruder alert! Intruder alert! Alright, this Team Rocket Grunt has three Pokemon. Out first is a Grimer! I'm so used to saying Rattata, I almost called Grimer Rattata. Let's use Shockwave! There we go, take it out in one shot! Alright, next up for the Rocket Grunt is going to be a Coughing. Alright, let's stay in. And let's use Shockwave. There we go. Alright, and the final Pokémon for the Rocket Grunt is another Coughing, and we are going to stay in. And Shockwave once more. And there we go. So, Jolteon is gonna grow to level 30. They grow up so fast. And that- oh, Double Kick. Uh, Alright, let's see. Sand Attack's been proven useful to me, but Double Kick does have double the power points, so I'll get rid of Sand Attack. Alright, Sand Attack gone, and Double Kick learned. And that is going to do it for this battle against this Team Rocket Grunt. I can't do it! Alright, there we go. Now let's head back down the stairs. And let's use that lift key. Without the lift key, you couldn't access this elevator, so you might want to pick that up. Anyway, basement four floor. You couldn't access this unless you have the lift key, so pick it up. All right. What do we got over here? Ooh, an item. I don't know why I did a complete circle just to pick up this calcium, but hey, I did it anyway. All right, and these two rocket grunts are guarding something. Or should I say, someone. I know you! You ruined our plans at Mount Moon! Alright, this Rocket Grunt has three Pokémon. Out first is going to be a Sandshrew. Oh, this puts a dent in my plan. Uh, it shouldn't know two super effective ground attacks yet, so I'll just use Return and keep Jolteon in. Okay, it knows Poison Sting, though. Mm, uh, of course. So Jolteon's poison now. Let's switch out into Nido King. All right, Defense Curl. It's also a good thing because Nido King can't be poisoned. Uh, Horn Attack should do it. There we go, critical hit. I don't think that mattered though, but. That's good, I, I guess. Anyway, experience for Nido King. Next up's going to be a Sand Slash. Let's stay in. Sand Slash is the evolved form of Sand True. And this Horn Attack is, wow. Sand Slash is pretty bulky. Didn't expect it to be that bulky. Uh, let's use Horn Attack again. All right. Another Poison Sting. You can't poison me, Sand Slash. Stop trying. And Double Kick to finish it off. There we go, a critical hit! Okay, good. Alright, the final Pokémon for this Team Rocket Grunt is going to be an Ekans. Uh, we'll stay in. Intimidate's gonna lower our attack, but that shouldn't matter. This Horn Attack should do a lot of damage. Oh, maybe that uh, Intimidate did matter, after all. Let's use Cut to finish it off. And there we go. Nido King. Oh, I thought he was going to grow to level 35. Oh well. But that's going to do it for this battle against this Team Rocket Grunt.
Alright, really quickly, let's delve into our bag, and let's use an antidote on Jolteon. There we go. And let's use, uh, Soda Pop. There we go, Jolteon's all healthy now. And let's talk to this grunt. How can you not see the beauty of our evil? Alright, this Rocket Grunt has three Pokemon as well, and out first is an Ekans. Intimidate's gonna lower our attack, but Shockwave is a special move, so that's not gonna matter. And there we go, Ekans down in one shot. Alright, the next Pokemon for this Rocket Grunt is going to be a Sandshrew, okay. Let's switch out into Nidoking. And let's use Horn Attack. Alright, Sand Attack, okay. This could be a problem. Double Kick, please hit. Yeah, there we go. Alright, that's gonna get Nidoking to level 35. And the next Pokémon for the Rocket Grunt is going to be an Arbok, the evolved form of Ekans. We'll stay in. Alright, Intimidate is gonna be a bit of a problem, but this Horn Attack should still do a lot. There we go, about half. Critical Hit Poison Sting. Okay. And it only did what, like three damage? Oh, so close. Oh, the Glare. Oh no. Yeah, that's gonna paralyze Nidoking. Uh, okay. Cut! Alright. Aw, oh, come on, Nidoking. You can do it. You can do it, Nidoking. Alright, our defense is gonna fall thanks to this Leer. Come on, Nidoking. Come on. Oh, come on! Another Leer? Yeah, there we go, Nidoking. That's how we do it. Alright, down goes Arbok, and that is going to do it for this battle against this Team Rocket Grunt. Ay -ay -ay -ay! Alright, that gate has opened. But before we go inside, we'll heal up our Pokémon. Alright, Paralyze Heal. For Nidoking? Alright. I don't know what lies beyond here, so I'm gonna quickly save. Alright, there's a guy here. I know there's hidden items in here, so let's see. Ah, there we go. A nest ball, which means the other one is on this side, this little corner. Yeah, there we go, a net ball! Excellent. Alright. Hello, sir. Who are you? So, I must say that I am impressed you got here. Team Rocket captures Pokémon from around the world. They're important tools for keeping our criminal enterprise going. I am the leader, Giovanni. For your insolence, you will feel a world of pain. And here we go, the first fight against Team Rocket boss, Giovanni. He has three Pokémon. Out first is an Onix. And we should have switched Jolteon out beforehand. But we have Double Kick, so that helps. Oh, baby! Critical hit just when I needed it! Thank you! And it's not going to use a Ground-type move, which is awesome, so I can actually go ahead and hit Double Kick again. There we go, Jolt! Wow, another critical hit on the second kick! Jolteon takes out Onix. So, one Pokémon down, and two to go. Next up is going to be a Rhyhorn. Alright, let's switch out. Send in Nidoking. king. 
All right, Rhyhorn, take this double kick. All right, so it can only survive one more turn. Let's see what it uses. Stomp. Oh. Poison point. Yeah. That was really a bad choice there, Rhyhorn. Or should I say Giovanni, but whatever. Anyway, another double kick. Okay, we only needed one thanks to the poison point. So, two Pokemon down and only one remains. And that Pokemon is a Kangaskhan. And we are going to switch out into Charizard. Kangaskhan is a tank, so you're going to want a very strong Pokemon to take this one on. Fake Out's going to make us flinch, but that's not going to matter. This Flamethrower should do a lot. Oh, wow, we got the burn. Excellent. All right. There we go. Take some burn damage, and let's use Metal Claw to finish it off. Oh, so close, but the burn's gonna take it out, so... Very good thing that we got that burn from that flamethrower. Down goes Kangaskhan. Charizard is gonna grow to level 39. And we have defeated Team Rocket boss, Giovanni. What? This can't be! I see that you raise Pokemon with utmost care. A child like you would never understand what I hope to achieve. I shall step aside this time. I hope we meet again. Oh, we will. Anyways, Giovanni is now gone and in his place, right in front of his couch is a Pokeball, which contains the Sylph Scope. Alright, and I'm going to quickly get out of here using an escape rope, because it's easier than walking downstairs. Alright, so we've defeated Team Rocket for now. So, next time on Pokemon Leaf Green, we will head back to Lavender Town and check out the Pokemon Tower. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.